What's up, everybody? It's the Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. Yeah, I'm awake and motherfuckers, I'm ready to do some videos tonight. Let me tell you people something. Nicole Kidman has lost her motherfucking mind. Can you believe this yet? She wants to do a performance of the AMC commercial for AMC with drag queens. Now, as the article is talking about people, she is saying how popular her fucking commercial has become. Nicole Kidman has a vision for a live performance of her popular AMC Theaters advertisement. The actress discussed the ever-growing popularity of her 2021 commercial for the movie ch theater chain. The ever-growing popularity of her commercial people. We come to this place for magic. We come to Guy MC Theaters to laugh. First off, bitch, you ain't made that popular. We paid you $25 million to make that commercial and it plays every theater at opening of every movie. To cry, to care, because we need that. You didn't make your face, your desire, to do a drag show at AMC has nothing to do with the popularity of your commercial. All of us, that indescribable feeling you get when the lights begin to dim and you go somewhere you've never been before. Your commercial's popular because we paid $25 million and we have a marketing firm that pushes it out. She goes on to say, my dream, now if you gotta have a dream, and this is your dream, you're a fucked up person. My dream would be to be on stage doing it with a drag queen. Dazzling images on a huge silver screen. Sound that I can feel. Somehow, heartbreak feels good in a place like this. Kidman told the outlet, of drag performers paying tribute to her famous We Made Movies Better ad, we got to be able to do that at some point. You got to be able to do what at some point, bitch? You got to be able to influence and bring that shit into the movie theaters where children will be watching a movie, where I'm going to be watching a movie, and I goddamn sure don't want to see a bunch of drag queens. If I want to see drag queens, and if you want to hang out with drag queens and Go on down there to Bourbon Street in New Orleans. That's where y'all all hang out and you do your motherfucking thing. Our heroes feel like the best part of us and stories feel perfect. This is my honest opinion on the situation, all right, is that they know they cannot pull this motherfucking company down. They can't. They've been trying to do it for three fucking years. And we have undergirded it. We have refused to fucking let it go. They know that. And now the so-called dead holders are meeting. And then Nicole Kidman wants to do a gay-ass fucking commercial to play in that front of every fucking Patreon at AMC that don't want to see that shit. Because here... They are. Guy MC Theaters. We make movies better. And they know that when they do it, they know the consequence. They're trying to force us into bankruptcy. And since they can't do it, they're going to try to manipulate us into a boycott to cause the fucking bankruptcy. And I'm going to tell you what, it ain't going to work. In fact, Nicole Kidman, from this point on, none of your movies will ever be watched in my house again and I will never go to a movie and see one of your shit. I'll never read another article. I will never do anything as long as it's concerning Nicole Kidman and wanting to bring this bullshit. And if y'all ain't seen the commercial, I can't take no more of it. That's enough. Y'all just gonna have to go Google it and watch it, you motherfucking selves. I can't watch that shit no more. And you want to put that in front of every Patreon that comes to our movie theaters, including children, to see crazy, wicked shit like that? I don't think so. But I'm going to tell you what. Don't let them push your buttons. 
We don't boycott AMC. It's not the theater. It's the management. It's these fucked up people like Nicole Kidman and everybody else whose whole desire is to destroy a hundred year old icon. They are trying to push our buttons and cause a boycott of AMC like they did to Bud Light, Chick-fil-A, and all the other places that got boycotted over this gay drag queen bullshit, all right? Come on, man. This country and world has gotten so fucked up. It's ridiculous. So, don't fall for their trap. We can message Adam Aaron over there at AMC and tell him they better not put no gay ass drag queen bullshit on our movie theater screens. We're fed up with their manipulative tactics thinking that they can control us and they need to realize we're not going nowhere. All right? So, what's the next topic up for bat tonight? 1,700 influencers on social media was hired by a company to put out information. I need to talk to y'all about that. It's not what everybody's saying it is. I'm going to take you to the receipt. I'm going to read you the article, and you'll understand why these 1,700 people are in trouble, and you'll know if you're a YouTuber if you're going to be in trouble, too. So, with that, that's the next video. Love y'all. Be blessed, and I'll see you then.